Hello YouTube, this is Dazza the Cameraman. Today is Monday, April 23, 2018. And uh, this is a look at how big the sun is. We're going to look at some lens flares and some other questions. I'm filming the sun with my Nikon P900. And let's take a look at how big the sun appears to be in the sky with all of the glare. As you can see, I've got a completely blue sky here today. So let's just pan around. We're looking at the lens flares moving around. Notice how the lens flares move in the opposite direction to the apparent motion of the sun in the video. So as the sun crosses the sky, then lens flares will move in the opposite direction. These small orbs that you see around the sun are simply caused by dust on the lens. I should have given the lens a clean before I started filming, but that's all that is caused by. Now, Take a look at how big the sun appears to be. When we look at the sun, it looks like it's very big in the sky, but most of what we see is actually glare. This is the bright sunlight being scattered through the atmosphere. We can't actually see the actual sun amongst the glare because the sun is so bright. So let's take a look at what happens when I use a filter. And in this case, I'm actually using a number 12 welding lens which you can buy from your local hardware store or engineering supply store for maybe two or three dollars. Um, if you're going to try this, um, you need to get a, a dark welding lens such as a number 12 or darker if possible. So let's take a look. So now we can see that the sun, the actual sun, is a lot smaller than what it appears with all of the glare. So that little green dot that we see is the actual sun. And if we were to measure its angular size, it would measure half of one degree, which is approximately the same angular size as the full moon. But as we can see, without the filter, the glare, the surrounding glare, is considerably larger than the sun itself. Now, I'm moving the filter around so that I'm getting the, the actual sun right in the corner so that you can see all around the edges of the filter there is no Nibiru or Planet X or anything like that that is uh, just out of view. And back to the sun with all of its glare. And look at how those lens flares move around in the opposite direction. 